I realized I have an obsession with camera straps because to me, the camera strap is what connects me to the camera. Other than my hands, obviously, it has to be secure, it has to be comfortable, and it has to look good. So there's three straps I wanna to compare today are all from Peak Design. First, we have the Peak Design slide. This is the original slide. I'm not sure what has changed since I bought it, but I got this quite a while ago. This is a good strap, and I often use this with bigger cameras like this, okay? If I'm bringing a heavier camera like my Sony a7 III with a bigger lens, then I'll often bring this combo right here. Especially if I'm using a bigger lens like the 100 to 400 by Sigma, you need a strap that can handle the weight as well as distribute the force across your shoulder. However, I'm not the biggest fan of this strap for two reasons. One, if you carry this camera around your neck, the neck portion is very stiff on the top of the strap. Imagine my hand is the back of your neck and you're bending your head backward. You would really feel the sharp edges on the strap. Now the material is a very comfortable material. However, the edges are slightly sharp. And I don't know about you, but I have sensitive necks. Whenever I'm looking up, I'm bending my neck backward. I feel like these areas always feel the pain. It is totally okay if you're using the strap strictly across your shoulder, this is the perfect strap for that. But if you are going to use this and wear this around your neck like a traditional strap, this may not be the most comfortable strap. However, it is a very secure strap. The second thing I don't like about it is the bulkiness. Look how bulky and fat this strap is. It's almost like it's gonna take up this a same amount of like my 50 millimeter lens just for a strap alone, okay? I bet you can fold this up and tuck this somewhere else. It is still a pretty thick strap overall. And when you're shooting it, oftentimes the strap will get in the way. There are many times when I'm using the strap and I'm shooting on the street, the strap will get in the way and get in front of the viewfinder instead of the screen. It just affects the way I shoot. So whenever I'm shooting, I would like to take the strap off and I just like to hold the camera by itself. I strictly pretty much use this to carry the camera from A to B. It's not the best way to use a camera strap, to be honest with you. And I feel like there has to be better options out there. The width is almost the, the same width as like a seat belt. And this is like your heavy duty strap. I don't think I'm the only one that feels like this can be an overkill if you're carrying something like a Leica Q2, where the camera is slightly lighter. You don't need that much of a heavy duty overkill strap for it. So the slight light would be perfect for something like this, which is still pretty heavy, but much lighter than the a7 III. The slight light feels exactly the same quality as the original slide. The little blue accent bolts are beautiful. Everything is just really well made. The strap thickness is nice as well. And then there's a nice gripping material on the very top right here. So you can flip it over and it can grip onto the shoulder so it won't slide around. But same thing as the original slide. Whenever I'm wearing this for long hours, the edges are too sharp. It needs more padding. And this, I feel like, would dig into the back of my neck after a long while and is uncomfortable to wear. Again, if you're wearing it diagonally like a seatbelt, great, no problem. It's still wide enough to help distribute the weight of the camera onto your shoulder nicely. But if you're wearing it like a traditional strap, you can tell very quickly that this is uncomfortable to wear. But overall, the slight light is a very well-made strap. It's like the happy medium between the original slide versus the leash. All right, the leash is the next next step of the evolution of my purchases. In this case, I bought this specifically for smaller cameras like my Ricoh GR3. You really don't need something heavy duty to carry a camera like this. This can fit inside my pocket. I want to have a strap that is equally as light and flexible so that I can just tuck this anywhere and take it off when I don't need it. So the Peak Design Leash to me is perfect for point and shoot and small cameras like this. This goes in the perfect pair. You can use the leash 
or something like the Leica Q2. However, I find that the Leica Q2's weight does cause this to start digging into the back of my neck. Again, whenever I'm shooting point and shoot like the Ricoh GR3 or my Leica Q2, I would just wear it around my neck like a regular camera strap. And after a while, especially if you're in hot climates, you're wearing a t-shirt and you're starting to get sweaty, this can kind of grip and like dig into your neck and it can get uncomfortable. Only if you're using a heavier camera. But if you're using something very light, you barely feel it. So this is the perfect strap for something like the Ricoh GR3. The Slide Light is a perfect strap for something like Leica Q2. Slide Light will also work for bigger DSLR cameras or mirrorless cameras as well. But if you want the most comfortable carrying experience for the heaviest amount of weight, then go with the original Slide. This is the Peak Design wrist cuff. This is the same strap material as the leash. All right, it's the same thickness. It's just different color. I got the green one. This is so beautiful. And I really like this. Whenever I'm not using a strap, I still want to keep the camera secure. I keep the wrist cuff on me. This attaches to my Leica Q2 as an example. And boom, this is nice and secure. I can just shoot one-handed if I want to. This is such a nice thing to have. So in addition to a Peak Design strap, I would recommend you guys getting the wrist cuff because I think this is worth the money and it gives you the flexibility to still use the Peak Design anchor and you're not carrying that much more extra weight, but this definitely keeps everything very secure around your wrist and it looks great.